Hi, I'm Kristen Burt for Red Carpet Report. This morning we are here for the 24th Annual Screen Actors Guild Award nominations. I am excited about this year's SAG Awards. I have to be like honest, like from the announcement, just How like... How great was that announcement? That was so good. Wasn't that good? I actually, after they did, I was like, I want to go back up. I want to be funny. Like, I could be funny. Sorry, no, that's good. <laughs> they were wonderful. Well, you know, I was saying, like, Nisi kind of ran with it. And then, Olivia, you either, like, melt down or you go with it. And she just, like, followed her right along. It was fantastic. It was wonderful. They're a good team. We're going to start a show called the Nisi and Olivia Show. I'm there for it, totally. <laughs> All right, so here's what I have to start out with. The host... What made you guys finally decide to have a host? Well, you know what? I think that we're always wanting to evolve. And so uh, we haven't done it before, and we thought, let's try it. And I think it's going to be really, uh, if you like this morning, you're going to love the show. Kristen Bell is such a great choice. Was it easy to pick her? Oh, my God. She's so, it was the greatest choice, and it was easy to pick her. And she is bright, and she's talented, and she's, she's so leaning into the world. She's great. She's really, it's going to be fun. And I heard this great bit of news, all female presenters this year. Wow. And we did that separate from what's going on. No. Yeah. What made you, so was it kind of based off of, no. last year we talked a lot about equality and women in the industry. Well, and this is something we work on as a union in sag After our, for us, it is about inclusion. And how do we go, how do you ask for inclusion and diversity if we don't reflect it? So this year is a real, was, we wanted to be able to focus on you know, a group of performers who are not always seen. Um, you know, they're put into the sidelines, is the, you know, not always right out front. So um, it's just, I guess it's kismet, right? It's all meant to be, but it'll be an exciting time. We're really celebrating the women of our industry. And I also love the way the nominations really celebrated really a wide variety of people and shows and movies. Um, you know, of course, we had Golden Globes just the other day, and I, I felt a little bit like, oh, I don't know what's going on here. And then I was like, all right, SAG is here. SAG AFTRA is, I, I'm always proud to say, I mean, for me to be able to, it really, to be president of a union that really is about, really walks the walk. And that's what you're seeing inside of these uh, nominations. This came from the performers peer to peer saying we love your work and we want you to be seen and recognized and we're voting for you so yeah I, I wasn't on the nomcom this year but but I'm excited to vote honestly because I, I was like there's a really good mix and there are a few people that I was like get outs there you know I was happy about that it was nice to see people that have been left off that are included this time around yeah it's, it's I'm telling you it's going to be a great 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 uh SAG Awards this year I'm very excited we are thrilled and always good to talk with you. And I'm so glad that you guys are kind of like leading the way and pioneering that. Okay. All of us lead the way, right? We do it together. You're doing it right now by talking about it. So everybody's got to watch January 21st, 5 o'clock Pacific time and 8 o'clock Eastern time. We'll be there. All right. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel, like this video, and in the comments below, let us know who your favorite nomination is for the SAG Awards. And be sure to check out SAG Awards Holiday Auction.